Hi, my name is Renata Wisht. I am a wildlife specialist here at the Cleveland Museum of Natural History, and we are in our sandhill crane exhibit, and I'm going to talk to you guys a little bit about our sandhill cranes um, named Niles and Daphne. Niles came from a wildlife center in Michigan. He was found um, at a truck stop picking bugs off the grills on the big trucks and was taken into the wildlife center. The hope was to reintroduce him into the wild, so he was introduced with some sandhill cranes, but um, he was just too tame. The introduction didn't go that well, so he didn't make a good candidate to be re-released. Um, so he came to us in July of 2014. Daphne has a right bum wing. She was born in the spring of 2011 and in January of 2014 um, she had a wing injury and came to the same um, wildlife center in Michigan. The injury was too bad that she couldn't be re-released into the wild. So sandhill cranes are the most abundant crane species um, in the world. They'll spend most of their year in the northern United States and Canada and then they will migrate south for the winter. Um, sandhill cranes are listed as endangered in Ohio, but there are breeding pairs that have been seen throughout Ohio and their numbers are increasingly rising year after year. And that's kind of due to the Ohio Division of Wildlife. Um, they're restoring habitats such as wetlands and grasslands, which is where these guys like to hang out. And these guys are monogamous, so cranes pick one mate and then during breeding season, they'll kind of do um, a courtship where they'll kind of dance and frolic and leap around each other. Um, they'll also call back and forth. It's a loud and low-pitched trumpeting, and it's unique due to their anatomy. And it's mostly seen during breeding season, but they do do it throughout the year. The lifespan of them in the wild is around 20 to 30 years, but in captivity, it's closer to around 60. These guys do eat small rodents, um, reptiles, amphibians, but they'll also eat um, berries and insects and grains. Um, we do do training with these guys. Um, they know target training. They are very interactive with different enrichment that we give them. Um, they like to check out hoses and badges and cameras and really anything that we put in here for them. Thank you for watching our creature feature um, on the sandhill cranes. Um, you can see them in our new Perkins Wildlife Center presented by KeyBank.